Welcome back guys. So the question really is, why do you want to get AWS certified? Okay, in the last couple of years, the technology, of course, is changing rapidly and we know this, this is nothing new, right? Enterprise organizations are struggling to adapt to these enterprise technologies. And why do these enterprise companies really would like to adopt these newer technologies, right? The only reason or the logical reason that is that they would like to adopt newer technologies is to stay efficient, right? They like to move towards automation. They like to work towards, let's say, workflow automation, right? To save money, save on costs, right? Reduce costs, increase profits. And that's really what the business is all about for these enterprise organizations. So coming back to AWS, why do you want to get certified in AWS itself? AWS is a cloud technology platform and that's exponentially growing. There's a huge shortage of technical individuals who are AWS certified, for example, or who have the required knowledge to be able to implement the infrastructure and the ecosystem itself. The first reason you like to get certified in AWS, right, or move towards AWS cloud, not just you know, there are other options as well, such as Google Cloud Platform is there. There's Microsoft Azure Platform. There's a Red Hat Platform. IBM has its own Bluemix Platform. So there's several cloud technologies. But AWS is by far the market leader, according to the Gartner Report. So the reason you like to get certified and get into this area is so that, of course, you can always earn money, right? That's the first part where it's important to have or increase your grow your career right earn six-figure salary that's a pretty decent start for a recent college graduate and more importantly even if you're not a college graduate i've had students who've simply taken these certifications right and just a couple of years of experience under the belt and they're now earning up to six-figure salary so only high school is required you can enter the market with a high school degree, get some certifications, get some experience, and then you're good to go. You're just as good as a college graduate. Now, of course, if you have a college degree or you're already in college, perfect. That's wonderful. Continue, graduate, and grow your career. Okay? But that's not a requirement anymore like it used to be, you know, a couple of years back or a few years back or whatever. So that's the number one reason why you want to get into AWS is because the future or the shortage and demand because of course it's all economics, right? The second reason apart from earning good salary and you know this economics, the second reason why you should get AWS certified is because the career itself, the ecosystem itself is growing exponentially. They're coming out with new services every single day. So if you're a passionate learner or individual who likes technology, this is a great venue. You will always find new things, new services, new projects, something new to do every single day. So you're not, you know, getting uh, stagnant, for example, or running into a monotonous environment. Okay. So that's the second reason and important reason why you want to get certified in AWS overall. This certification or this ecosystem, this particular cloud technology is fairly easy to use. And that's the third reason why you want to get AWS certified as compared to Microsoft or other platforms, right? So this is a fairly easy technology to adopt, learn, and then apply. So these are my three tips why you want to get certified in AWS. If you have any questions, post in the discussion area. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. I come up with these new tutorials, courses, so that you can gain knowledge and understanding. Hope this helps. I'll see you in my next lecture.